some of these other horses. This is number five. This is Souffle, and Ben Webster is the driver of this colt. And Kenny Rice spoke with uh, Ben Webster a little bit earlier about his colt and other races in this Breeders' Crown Series. Kenny? I'm in the paddock with Ben Webster, the driver of Souffle. How does he look coming into tonight's race, Ben? Well, Kenny, he's, uh, he's a nice colt. The, the people who just bought him here recently, and he raced awful well at Garden State two weeks ago, and uh, I'm certain that he'll make a good account of himself. Now, a couple of weeks back in Canada, you had a horse that a lot of people wanted to see race, flat bait. He did not race. Why is that? Well, we had some problems with the uh, Ontario Racing Commission, and uh, I had applied for my license six weeks prior to that event in hopes to uh, get a hearing with the commission. Uh, the commission went through a, a complete turnover and uh, they didn't get around to a hearing. Uh, they had given me one on the 13th of November. I had requested one earlier so that I could race my flag paint horse up there and try practice. And I think that he's equal or damn near as good as practice. And uh, they wouldn't give me a hearing and I entered him in the Breeders' Crown, hoping that I could force the issue. We've had a bit of controversy surround this race. A horse owned and driven by Ben Webster was not allowed to race, so we asked the chairman of the Ontario Racing Commission to comment on it, Frank Dre. The Ontario Racing Commission barred flak bait from racing here tonight. Why? His owner, Ben Webster, is barred in New York State, therefore he's barred in Ontario. Is that an automatic? Yes, it is. Now, what about the $10,000 entry fee? Yeah. Must he pay that? Yes, he has to pay that. And he knew full well what he was doing because he tried uh, several ways to get a license here, but he backed off and he found out he'd be cross-examined under oath by me. So flak bait is out, and we do have a field of eight 